In this edition of Small Business Champions, we asked local business owners about their experience applying for JobKeeper. Council is proud of our local businesses that are working hard to retain staff and adapt to these challenging circumstances. I hope you enjoy the conversation. At one point we thought that two of our employees didn't qualify and then they did. Um, and then we had casuals obviously that didn't qualify at all. But thankfully I have a really good accountant and they um, managed the whole process through the portal for me and ran all of the reports and did all the registration. I think the biggest issue was carrying the $30,000 wage bill until the supplements or reimbursements hit the bank account. So. Our experience in applying for the JobKeeper grants was uh, was quite a simple one. Um, we did find the process easy. We had quite a few staff that were eligible, which was great. Um, and particularly when we had to close the bar here in Gilbert Street, it meant that we um, we could uh, keep our staff on, which has been amazing. Uh, and it's just as a business, it's really helped us keep afloat. But we've got uh, 28 staff now on JobKeeper. We're reskilling those staff now. Everyone's happy back at work and grateful that we're able to do it. A fair bit of money paid out for salary, uh, but we're, we've, uh, we've done that and uh, we've had two pay runs now on JobKeeper. Once uh, we started um, trying to apply, there were so many things that sort of needed to be uh, done and clarified because we let the accountant, well, first we thought we'd do it ourselves, but then we thought it might be better to go pin the accountant and let him do the hard work. And just today, and I think we sort of probably started doing that three weeks ago, but just today we got the good news that we actually managed to fill in the application and get it registered. My experience in applying for JobKeeper was easy enough, if not a little bit confusing, in that I do have an accountant, I do use a bookkeeping system, Zero, but uh, I still wanted to do as much as I could of that myself. It is easy enough to actually apply for it, to enrol and go through that process. You do press a few buttons, but it was just confirming GST turnover, understanding what that actually meant. As a relatively new business owner, I'm still learning a lot as I go along. So really, it was just a case of understanding exactly what the requirements were, making sure that I met those and that I could yeah, I guess be eligible for it. Support for small businesses is a major part of the City of Adelaide's $4 million city support package. We've established a small business task force and are providing regular updates via our City Business Newsletter. To get all the latest information delivered to your inbox, subscribe today at cityofadelaide.com.au forward slash business.